the first impression that I had is the aesthetic is really good compared to the monster arms of the market it's a bit rough and chunky so this has got a smoother finishes to it and it looks really nice aesthetically the first thing I realized the movement it has got much more movement compared to the other brands and you can move it like up and down sideways 360 degree which is excellent so I had a couple of people ask me whether what if I've got a Blackberry and iPad do you have an arms and this is a good solution and I think people using a lot more iPad and things like that it will be much more easier to sell and much more acceptable in the marketplace yeah. I think it's a beautifully designed product the design of it is, is crisp and sharp I like it a lot Um, well, CBS has, has been around for a long time and, and has had a big association with a lot of big names, um, you know, in the market overseas. I mean, personally, I've uh, been lucky enough to use it in, in the Middle East and in Eastern Europe and, and, and now working down here in Australia. It's, it's a worldwide product. It, it's not particular to any market. So, um, you know, the CBS label has uh, a name that has got history as well as good coverage around the world. I think it's known for its strength, its design and, and, and longevity. I mean, uh, I can go into places where I, I see a CBS arm that's been in there for many, many years and it's still looking good. CBS always known making good monitor arms, but this one in terms of, I would say, probably the aesthetic is much better than the rest. Yeah, it's more refined. The ability to change that from a normal, sorry, normal monitor to a Blackberry or iPad is really good because with that function, the user can just do it whenever they want it rather than normal monitors, you have to get probably the IT guy or a technician to come in and do it, adjust it for you. First impressions, very impressed. Yeah, look, I mean, it's, um, it's an unusual looking arm. It's uh, a bit different to some of the others on the market. I, I like it. I think it's going to cause a bit of a, a, a reaction out there. You know? Uh, the range is quite large in terms of weight of monitors I and mean, I've just seen the iPad mounting as well which is uh, quite interesting so I'm sure that will take off as well. Yeah, I think it's dynamic. I mean it's sleek so it looks good, it's quite sophisticated, there's um, less is more and I think that product, um, Float product has it. A lot of architects and specifiers would love it for their own home and I think you know they always like to brag and show off their own products so I can definitely see them having it in their own home office. For the touchscreen technology, it would be great. And I think, you know, for hospitality, um, you know, a lot of technology is combining TVs and computers together, so it would be good for that. We'll be bragging about it to lots of people, yeah.